Kyle Jarvis is leaving Lancashire and returning to play international cricket for Zimbabwe. The fast bowler has asked the club to be released from his contract, which was due to expire at the end of next season, to resume his test career. He has been linked with a move back to his homeland for some months, but stated in August that he would remain at Emirates Old Trafford until at least the end of the 2018 campaign. However, he has now decided to leave the club a year early and was left out of Lancashire's final match of the campaign against Surrey. Jarvis joined Lancashire Emirates Old Trafford in 2013 after playing eight tests and has been the club's leading wicket-taker in the county championship in both 2015 and 2016. This season he has taken 37 wickets at an average. I have absolutely loved my time at Lancashire over the last four years, said Jarvis. It's a very special place, and I have made some fantastic friends here. I am immensely proud to have played a part in the history of this great club. I would like to thank everyone that for making me feel part of it. Lancashire's Kyle Jarvis image Simon Pendride has been a really hard decision to make to return to Zimbabwe, but the opportunity to return home and play international cricket is something I really want to do. I would like to thank Glenn Chapel and the club for releasing me, and I wish them well, in what is a hugely exciting time for Lancashire as a whole, both on the playing perspective and how they are to grow the game in the county. Lancashire signed Keaton Jennings from Durham on four-year deal There is a fantastic group of players in the Lancashire changing room, and I wish them all the very best of luck in the years ahead. Andrew Flint off back at Lancashire as Paul Allen is made cricket director Lancashire head coach Glenn Chapel said the club completely respects Kyle's wishes to go back home and play international cricket for Zimbabwe, and it's a great opportunity for him to show what he can do against some of the best players in the world. We are obviously going to miss Kyle in the changing room and on the pitch. On behalf of the whole coaching staff, players and everyone at the club, I'd like to wish Kyle every success in the future. He will always be welcomed back to Emirates Old Trafford.